So you want to stream to Facebook Gaming, but you don't have an Elgato capture card? Don't worry, fam. I got you. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can stream to Facebook Gaming and YouTube Gaming off of a PS4 or a PS5 uh, without a capture card or anything like that. You're going to need a laptop or a MacBook in order to make this work, but most people have those things, so it should be fine. What is good, everybody? I'm Dat Samurai, and my mission is to help you start and grow your streams. So if that's something you guys are looking to get help with, I am your guy. Before we get started, just make sure you samurai slice that like button and subscribe for more video content like this. But without further ado, let's get it. All right, guys, so here we are on the PS5, and I'm just going to tell you guys how this works. Basically, what we're going to do is a restream from YouTube Gaming to Facebook Gaming uh, by doing a share screen kind of setup. First, I'm going to show you guys how to set up your PS5 to stream directly to YouTube Gaming, uh, to your YouTube account. Basically, all you got to do is go to settings here. Um, you're going to come down and go to users and accounts. Um, come here down to link with other devices and you want to make sure that your YouTube is linked to your PS5 here as you can see I already have a setup it says linked so we're all good um, it's probably easier to do it on PS5 they made it really simple um, the PS4 there's a few more steps you got to take but it's basically the same thing you go and you connect your linked accounts and in order to get it started you got to start up a game so we're gonna start up uh, Genshin oh schnitzels all right, cool. So I got Genshin fired up here. You just got to start a game in order to do this. You're going to hit the little share button on your controller on the PS5. It's just this little thing. It's the same place on the PS4 controller. Um, the little share button, you're going to go over to the right and go to broadcast. And uh, once you're, you know, already got your account set up and everything, you're going to name your, you know, broadcast whatever you want to name it um and you're going to set it to private or if you're going to do a restream i would you know have it public but in this case since this is a test for me um i'm going to go ahead and set it to private and you're going to go live all right guys so as you see we're here streaming uh to youtube right now and everything looks good um from here you want to go over to your facebook gaming page and go ahead and set up a live all right cool so when everything's loaded up you're going to go ahead and give your uh stream a title uh, description for me test test that's all I need and how this is gonna work basically we're just gonna share you we're gonna go and click on this uh, setting here use camera and share our screen which is this guy right here and um, you can do this either with the whole screen a window or a tab so what I'm going to do is use a tab which should be this guy right here and as you can see here we're sharing the screen now um, and you want to go ahead and just full screen it. It should pop up in its own little window here. So you can, you know, you're still able to switch between ta tabs. So we're going to go back and make sure that, you know, everything is looking good over here on Facebook, which it is. Here we go. There's your stream. As you guys may have known, I have already made a video showing you how to do this before, but I kind of glanced over the audio. So here is how you get the audio to work. So if you see down here, you can see that there's uh, a little mic icon and a uh, drop down box. This basically is saying, hey, where do you want your mic to come through? Um, well, we don't want a mic to come through. We want to have a uh, channel that can feed feed the desktop audio into that mic, into this mic input. And in order to do that, we're going to download this program that will allow you to uh, create a new channel. Uh, for your output and make that go into your mic input and that you can select here So I'll put a link down in the description for this pro Program here, but it's called VB audio software and you want to download that that's for Windows you want to download that um, And once you download that and get it installed on your Windows, you're gonna find that um, You're gonna have a new uh, audio audio setting here um, I already have it selected uh, it should automatically become selected once you download it that's what happened with me so I'm, I'm expecting everybody's like that but if not it's easy to just go down here and select it you should have input and an output um, and if you go to your settings you should see that there is an input and an output cable and now this is literally grabbing audio from your desktop so after that, you want to jump back over to uh, your Facebook and you want to make sure that that input is selected here for um, your uh, mic input here. And that's going to capture your gameplay audio, your audio from your desktop that's coming from YouTube and going into your Facebook stream. One more note, you want to make sure also that your desktop, if you're streaming on like a monitor or a high resolution PC, that your, your desktop resolution is 
1080p, something around there. Um, Facebook's max resolution is 1080p, and if you have anything higher than that, they're gonna throttle your uh, your connection speed to the stream, so you're gonna have like streaming issues. You want to go ahead and just change your resolution of your desktop to um, you know 1080p. All right, guys. So the only way I could show you guys that this is actually working is to show you the Facebook page, the live stream on my phone, which I'm going to go ahead and do right now. So I'm recording my phone screen right now. And as you can see, we have audio, which is awesome. And if you have anything like a Bluetooth, like the PlayStation 5 Bluetooth headphones or um, another mic plugged into your controller, anything like that. Um, right now I'm muted, but basically you will get the audio. That's going to be your mic basically for, for, uh, the PS5 or the PS4. All right guys. So that is how you can restream from your PS5 or PS4 to YouTube gaming. And then from there to Facebook gaming all for free, uh, without an Elgato capture card or anything like that. If you have any questions at all, let me know down in the comments section. I will be down there helping you guys, you know, like normal. If you got any value at all from this video, go ahead and hit that like button. I greatly appreciate it. And also share it i'm going all in on helping you guys reach new levels in streaming as i am reaching new levels in streaming i want to come back and you know bring you guys up with me uh that's kind of the whole point of this whole thing i just want to you know kind of document this journey and document it with you guys and we all just make it together you know what i'm saying in the meantime if you have any other questions check out these videos over here uh hopefully they'll help you out and i'll see you guys in the next one. Oh, the tornado take me up scotty Wait, so are you going are you going in or are you staying out? Oh, okay, like, uh, yo, oh my God, yo, yo, I can't see anything.